Hello everyone, this is Alyssa from Alyssa's World. Welcome back to my channel for yet another DIY. This is actually part one of two toilet themed DIYs that I'm doing on this channel. Now, this series is actually dedicated to my mom. You might be asking yourself, hmm, why exactly would she be dedicating this to her mom? Well, that's a very good question, YouTube. <laughs> it's actually a kind of an inside joke of hers and kind of a long story, but simply put, long story short, my mom has a thing about toilets. Uh, she had an apartment about two years ago that had like a buttload of toilets in the basement. It was actually uh, kind of scary, but uh, <laughs> that year she had me paint a big portrait of her t basement toilets for her Christmas, and I've been kind of giving her toilet gag gifts ever since because, I mean, gag toilet gifts are endless. Literally, seriously, I gave her an ashtray shaped like a toilet, and inside of the bowl it said ass tray. I know, right? I should get a freaking Daughter of the Year award. <laughs> but on a serious note, if you've been following along so far, you've probably guessed by now that I'm making some toilet cleaner bombs. Similar to a bath bomb, except not made for your exfoliation time. Sorry, ladies. These suckers are a great alternative to cleaners that you get from the store, because you've probably got most of these items already laying around in your house. So when you spritz your dry mixture with your wet mixture, you want to make sure you really mix well as you're doing it so that you don't activate the citric acid. We want the toilet bomb to fizz in the toilet, not in the mixing bowl. Keep mixing until your spritz bottle is empty and you have sort of a damp sand texture. Take your tablespoon measurer and scoop the mixture into it. Pack it in tightly and then slap these bad boys onto a flat surface with wax paper on it. Don't worry if things get a little messy, just pack it back up and redo it and you'll be all set. Wait 24 hours for the bombs to set, then pack them into your jar. Then you're done! Moment of truth! Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe to see my next DIY video. Bye guys!